Minister of State for Lands Dr. Sam Mayanja together with the RCC of Machindie Mark Vaingana convened a meeting after the demolition of the Body of Christ Church in Kizungu Zone Machindie Division. The church according to its founder Pastor Zebron Isoke was established in 1990 after a piece of land was donated to them by the late Salim Sempa. 2023. Mo mo nkumi bili abili mo March. Ogwokusatu. We acquired the rest of the of the plot. Following Sempa's death in 2018, his son and heir Nathan Ochan took control of the land, sparking a court battle that forced the church to temporarily vacate the land. Around that time, Ochan sold the land to one Vakashawa for 180 million shillings, which was paid in installments. Our problem started when one time Omulundi gwali gumu e bakasaba Anthony e mu omuntu gabaita bakashaba Anthony storm into our place najja mu kifo kya fe he said you are in my place natugamba anti muri mu kifo kya you are a trespasser can permea past is okay This place is for Pastor Isoke. During a village meeting, Bukashaba told the minister that he agreed to pay the land in installments, which he delayed completing following the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic that severely hit the hotel industry. Tony, now, let's forget about Tony. I'm called Anthony, sorry. Let's forget about Tony. Now we want to deal with you directly. At the end he had paid 125 million shillings, leaving a balance of 54 million shillings. Unknown to him, however, Ochan went behind his back and sold the entire land including the plot occupied by the church to the church leadership which completed the full purchase, 223 million shillings, and managed to secure the title transfer and paperwork from Buganda Land Board. When you have a title But what followed was a brutal show of force that culminated into the demolition of the church building which act the RCC of much in the division Mark Vaingana described as unthinkable he has therefore promised to investigate the matter to its logical conclusion I'm swearing that within one week we will be knowing And you who did it any time you look for where to run to RCC Vaingana also faulted the businessman for overstepping boundaries and exerting extreme force on the Christians you who are there and are waiting to grab other people's land that your your elder people worked for you and you just stay thinking that because you have mass or you got still land it is evening deciding on the matter minister Mayanja informed Bakash that he ended up putting himself in a tricky situation when he failed to complete the purchase of the land something that was exploited by the seller Nathan and the church he ordered the RCC and the DPC to conduct investigations and order the arrest of Bukashaba's lawyer assembly he has disrupted a lawful assembly therefore he should be charged arrested charged and prosecuted according to the law that's the order overall direction of the RCC provide adequate security for the church amen for, for as long as they need to be secure to enjoy quiet possession of their property uh, also the report which has make sure the report is finished within a week week is too long enough i believe even today Minister Mayanja advised Bukashaba to look for Nathan in order to get his money back. Sadam Mubale, Jamil Sekaja, UBC News.